Is it Martin? Martin. Martin? Yeah. Uh, Martin has asked to uh, film, so I just want to make sure that everybody uh, understands that this will be filmed. And that's uh, part of open meeting law to ask permission, which he has. Um, and at this time, I um, want to ask if there's anybody that has um, a comment or a question or anything they'd like to ask or say. I do a public comment that unless I have my dates wrong, will the charter school not have been open one month this Thursday? One month. This Saturday. 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 Well, didn't we open on Thursday? Yeah, but not everyone Oh, I said how you're figuring your Okay. <laughs> <laughs> by Thursday, not by day. So we're today this close. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm talking about by day. Yeah, four yeah. weeks. Sounds good. Yes. So far, so Birthday celebration. Yeah, I hope you noticed the. Uh, Sculpture in the uh, parking lot there. She didn't get to see it daylight. Like, you can like to see it daylight. Like, like, day like. We have been told there is a leash law, so we won't get that. Anything else? Is everybody signed in? Everybody came in. Thanks. says this amount of money and this group says this amount of money and I think we should go with this one. I'm going to make the decision is what I'm saying. Correct. Does that make sense? Yeah, it's the question okay. of whether or not the minutes are reflecting that. Yes. And if they are, then we're all set. Do you want to make changes? How, How, you, know? How you move ahead is just yeah. the executive director. Right. Right. Does it feel like that's what these minutes say? Yes. Okay. So, yeah. Perfect. Fine. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. This, that was my question. Okay. So, all in favor? Aye. Aye. Um, 
Next on the list is the commissioner's list uh, update. Um, Just, Amy, before we go on to that, yeah. can, uh, can we talk about any adjustments to the agenda? Yes, I, I, I forgot I to put facilities, facilities on there, there yeah, and yeah. the Kumbhada did come yeah, to that's give us an update. Okay. That'd be great. Um, so, can we just move to that? Facilities? An update on the facility? Yes, please. Okay. Um, it's, uh, well, as far as this week is concerned, um, about three quarters of the carpet's down right now. Um, and on Wednesday, they're going to start putting windows in the multi purpose room. Um, all the heating AC units, there's 12 of them on the roof, they're all up there. They, they worked um, all last week, this weekend, doing 10 hour days, and um, they're all wiring the 12 units on the roof. Um, let's see here. Uh, all the grout is done, all the vinyl composition tile is down in the multi, not uh, in the art room and the science room and wherever you can put it, it's all set. Um, the, uh, the hallway going through to the multi-purpose room is all cut in now, so it's just one slab, one hallway walking right through, real nice. Uh, and they finished framing the, um, where the two extra rooms are, like you know, the um, uh, kitchen repair room, if you want to, I don't know what you're calling that room over there, but that's all framed out now. All the rough electricals down in the multi-purpose room, um, and all the metal should be here by Wednesday or Thursday at the outside of the building. And as soon as it's here, the company at Newburyport is all set to just jump on and put it all together. Um, let's see here. Did I miss anything? Um, as far as timing, um, I, I Tony, I understand you spoke, spoke to Anthony today, yeah. and uh, I talked to Anthony on the way down here. Uh, reiterate what you guys talked about, but for the most part, the we'd like to get things all set by the end of the first week of November. However, the multi-purpose room is going to take another week, so um, and you have to get your inspections on top of that. Okay, so you're right around the second week or so, and, and as far as moving date and whatever you want to do, what whatever weekend or how you want to pull that off, that's you know whatever you guys want to do. They're here, they're not going anywhere right now. These mods, so um, I have to make a decision when to pull these out, um, but I want to pull them out as soon as I can. Um, as soon as you go over, I want them to come down and pull these right out here. Okay? Any, any questions on that? I don't think we're moving. Moving, moving won't be a <laughs> hugely involved process. <laughs> Most everything here needs to go over here. <laughs> <laughs> right. At five point, right? <laughs> what we can get the floor. We can get the kids in that early five in the morning to do the work, right? We will boldly go where we'll be for the work. It does. It's uh if we were just over there, um with our hard hats on. And uh it, it's amazing. It's an amazing space. Yeah, I, I like um uh, for the, some of the parents who haven't seen it yet, um the colors. Are right. just like oh, okay. boom, uh, you know, very vibrant. Yeah, even the floor in the art room is enough. I mean, without anything else, it's really, really something. Did you get a chance to talk to Anthony about the floor in the multi-purpose room? Well, only one. Yeah. I do. Because I can't see that floor being in there and playing volleyball or Batman or whatever you're going to be doing. So I think it, it would be very confusing. Yes, it would be. <laughs> Yeah. Just for those who are sort of listening, uh, the um, there were initially the, there was some thought that we'd be ordering the same tiles that are in the art room for the multi-purpose room, which also will function as a theater space, a dance space, a gym space with lines on the floor for certain uh, sports. And if you have three or four different colors of tile, uh, it would make it really interesting trying to both referee and play on such a service. You need 3D glasses. <laughs> <laughs> so you know, we thought better of that. You know, be getting uh, one color. I, I think it's a very, very good idea. Yeah, all the lights are in. Uh, they're all installed. Those are all in. So um, it's just uh, a lot of just a lot of cosmetic stuff right now. So it's but the, but there's a lot of that. You know? Yeah, the carpeting's all. Is it all in? Uh, it's yeah. I just took a walk with it. I, they started putting it down. I guess prior today, and I would say three quarters of it is all done. Even you know, ninety percent is all done. 
So that's uh, that's nice. I talked to the landscaper today on the way down. He wants to know when I needed them. So I uh, just said, you know, about you know, two weeks off, three weeks off, and make it look nice as it all comes around. So that's it. Yeah, no. so November 2nd is the next meeting, right? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, by that time, I mean, mm -hmm. I think we should be looking really, really good. So. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks for your um, okay, so commissioner's list and the board training is going to get lumped into that. So, um, can, we, can we add to what we yes. were just talking about in the, in the trustees committee? Mm -hmm. Yeah, the board training that was. Yeah. Oh, add, add to well, the board we'll training. The board will call it capacity. Yeah, yeah. Yes. So, why don't we do the list first and then we'll get sure. to that? Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay. Could um, yeah, we add just something about uh, curriculum as well, just an update on this <coughs> that. Any trainings or you know, actions taken in there? Yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, you know what, I'm going to suggest that we just do those first and we'll go back to the list because then we'll maybe answer some of those questions, I guess. So do you want to begin with the what we just did? Yeah, why don't we talk about board capacity? Um, do you want to talk about that? Sure. Um, we met um, Jay first on this. Uh, I was sick. Um, <coughs> otherwise, would have been there as a member of the, of the uh, committee on trustees. This was Tony, Amy, myself, and 